How do I generate SQL for a specific set of tables and all their dependent objects, where I am only looking for tables that belong to one or two specific creators? I also do not want any utility statements. RC Migrator can be used to generate pure SQL. The SQL may not in fact be executed at all, but may be used in order to provide information about the contents of the DB2 catalog to users who don't have access to it. It could also be manually altered and executed on another location than its original source by developers, for example as the starting point of new work. In this case they don't want any utility statements generated. It could also be used as input to a DDL2 SSID compare on another subsystem, which does not have connectivity to the source subsystem. Let us see an example. First, create a RC Migrator migration strategy. On the Create Migration Strategy screen, place an E next to table in the primary object type specification. E stands for Explode. This option will select all of the chosen primary objects and all their dependent objects which include indexes, views etc. Next we need to specify the specific creators that we are targeting. The creator field at the bottom of the screen only provides for one creator, but if we use the where field we can get around this restriction. Place a Y in the where field. You will be presented with the SQL selection panel screen. Here we can enter a WHERE clause that will get the tables we want. You will see normally 8 lines of SQL text that we can enter free text into. Then there is an order by and under that you can see a list of columns on the SIS IBM SIS tables catalog table. In the first line of text we enter this statement. Demo 110 and Demo ADM are the two creators that we are looking for. Then press enter. And the line is resolved like this. The colon 2 is replaced with a creator which is the second column on the list at the bottom of the page. PF3 out of this and the strategy is saved. It saves the strategy like this because there are no selections to be made manually. The strategy will assess the WHERE clause when it does the analysis and will pick the tables to process at that time based on that WHERE clause. Next we do the analysis. We want RC Migrator to produce only SQL no utilities or other syntax that is not SQL. In strategy analysis options, we select these three options. No auth set to yes will produce no dot auth authorization ID statements to clutter up our SQL. Setting the second option to s will produce SQL only with no utility statements that would also clutter up our SQL. Commit ASAP set to yes will produce commit work statements instead of sync statements. We don't want any sync statements in our SQL. When finished with these settings PF3 back and submit the analysis with these options. When the analysis is finished, you will see the usual RC Migrator header information and the impact analysis and change analysis reports. Note the options that we selected. The analysis will contain only the tables that have creators that match our in clause with all the indexes, views and anything else hanging under the tables. No utility statements, no syncs and no no dot auths. Just pure SQL statements will be generated as we intended. The SQL where clause could be augmented to be much more particular than this example, depending on your requirements. The SQL can then be used by developers as they generally don't want to know or need to know what table spaces their tables have been created in. The DBA normally worries about such placement and storage allocations. The other benefit of this pure SQL is, that it can be executed by other programs that can run SQL, like Spoofy, DSN Tap 2 or QMF, on another system without having to do any work to clean out any RC Migrator specific syntax. On CA support, you can find a document with more details. Thank you for taking time to watch this video.